Hi, I'm Anna or Anna G Writes and Reads on pretty much all platforms. And today I'm gonna to transform this little space behind me. So between our yellow lights and the brown wood, I really wanna to try to brighten it up a bit. So let's see how we can do that. So we'll take the space from this to this. This is the before of what my working space looked like. So before this transformation, I would record all my videos leaning up against this. Now I have the tripod, which is really nice. See, if I ever wanted to do another YouTube video, I'd be at this weird angle, which I don't want to be at. So the tripod fixes that first step, which is nice. Uh, but now we're going to work on the lighting, the coloring of the bookshelves. And then what you're on right now, we also have to organize. All right, so I have Ubeezy's lights or what we bought from Amazon. It's the same brand as my tripod and I really like my tripod, so I wanted to try and go with these lights. Okay, here's the lighting after. Uh, let me turn them off real quick and show you what it was before. Oh yeah, so I so this is with them off. I feel like you can totally see a difference. So I did dim these a little bit. Let me turn them up to full brightness so you can see what they look like. That's our full, our full brightness. I know, I don't think the yellow walls help very much, but I feel like this is at least, we're getting better. And then this is with all the other lights completely off. I don't know. I don't necessarily hate this either, but what I don't like is the color of this bookshelf. So let me show you how I'm gonna fix that because my husband told me these don't paint very easily, but I have an idea. So I saw on a TikTok account because I used to work as a landlord and so I'm all for those hacks of how to personalize your space. This is actually removable wallpaper. So this is the first one because I wanna put this on my TBR shelf it's like a little marbles type color. And then for my completed shelf, I have this blue, which I think is gonna look really nice with the new lights. So now I gotta take off, I gotta take off all these books and put these on, but I'm not going to take off every single book. I'm just gonna do one shelf on each just to test and see if this is even gonna work. harder to use than this one. I feel like the blue went on so easy. There's still like some air underneath here, which like, I think, you know, just because there's edges on the bookshelf, I'm gonna have figured out. This was so hard. So I think I'm not gonna try to do like the whole shelf in one piece. I think I'm gonna like cut these in half and worry about like covering the front and then cover the back. And then I do wanna cover at least up back here where you can see the books. So we're gonna try this again. So this is what it looks like so far. Is it perfect? No, of course it's not. Um, these little parts are sticking out quite a bit. So I might just like reinforce them with tape you know, if I like push them down, but I just think there's so little overhang on these because I'm using leftovers right now that I think I'm just gonna have to like put some tape, which is like not a big deal. Um, this is way stickier than this. And so I think if I were to do like, once I add this little overhang piece, I feel like it's just gonna stick a lot better. So yeah, I just did like a little overhang piece and this is way stickier. I do need to leave like a little bit, but it's not too bad. So what I think I'm gonna do is I really just care about like these exterior wood pieces today. So I'm gonna make sure I have enough to do those. And I might not even take the books off for those just to make sure that I have enough because I only have two rolls of the blue and I feel like I'm going through it kind of quick. So I'm just gonna do like these overhangs, hopefully do all the outer edges and then we'll see what it looks like. I feel like that's not terrible. 
terrible there are like if you were to ever be here for whatever reason and you went really close there's like air bubbles but there's like lips on all of these shelves i can't take them out and do this we got these bookshelves for free on facebook marketplace so you know like we're working we're working with what we got here this is more of the height i think that i would fill most of my sitting videos at i feel like that's pretty good so far this little lip i didn't give enough to like hang over so i might put some tape there but again i feel like at least it looks brighter so i'm gonna try to do this and with this shelf because it's so low and same thing with here i might have to do the whole thing from like front to back again whereas i've been doing like half for these two and half for this one up here so i might need to do that this here even though i like the texture the blue it's not sticking as well as this one is so the nice thing is because it's removable wallpaper i can just change the colors which is nice so i'm gonna try the blue for now and see how i feel same thing with the white but we'll see what happens i'm also not gonna record this part because that's just had a weird angle but i'll show you more what like our quote finished project looks like i'll finish the edges and i'll finish the shelves so i'll just do these three shelves because that's mainly what's in my video i don't know if i'll do the back yet i have to see how much wallpaper i have all right i'm through one row of the paper and i think it looks good mainly you know looking on camera for now until I get all the pieces together. But I have another row of each, so let's see how much I can get done. All right, so this is with a lot of the edging done. It's a little patchworky because I can't take out the shelves. Um, so I might try to work on that. But overall, we like I like the color. Here's the upper shelves. So I think it's like a really good start. Uh, I'm gonna try to do the back of them now so I can put my books back on. All right, so this is what we're working with now. Again, I might have to try to figure out like placements of the lights. As you can see, like the sides aren't yet done, but, or the tops, like right there, like th those top parts, um, cause I didn't have enough rolls. So definitely gonna order two more of those. Um, Amazon said they should be here tomorrow. I don't know what time they're gonna be here tomorrow. So you'll see in the next clip when they're here. Amazon was a little late. I'm still trying to work out my lights. I definitely like my lights. I don't know how much like shadows bug people, but I think eventually I'll learn placements and whatnot. I feel like this is at least a little bit better. So Amazon was late. This is actually two days later than when I started this project. I have the blue here. As you can see, I learned I could take out the shelf. That's really fun. This is screwed in, so I don't really wanna take that out because I'm not that handy. Same thing with this shelf. This shelf is also screwed in. This is not. So I can lift up those shelves later to help finish the project. So with these two blue rolls, hopefully what I'm gonna do is be able to do the sides, the top, and the sides down here. Once I get the white roll, it's gonna be the same deal, doing the top, the sides, whatnot. I am not sure again if I want lights or not, if I do, I might have that be another video. I'm also debating making this like seasonal because it's just peeling wallpaper. And I feel like my colors are kind of wintry with the blue and the white. So we'll see. I don't know, but let's get going on this. <laughs> different things out with the lighting. I had them a different way before. Um, so it'll probably take me a while. I'll probably have to do some research just to see like where best to put these. But look at this. I love this. I know I see, I see that part too. I still have some touch-ups to do, but overall I feel like she looks good. Don't, don't look at those air bubbles right here. Um, I'm just kidding. No, it's not going to be 100% perfect. This was kind of harder to do down here without, you know, being able to take off the top. 
being able to take off the top here was like super nice. Um, so there's going to be, you know, and the wood too. Wood. It's not real wood. Isn't a hundred percent perfect, but overall I still like the look of it. And I definitely like having the whole thing covered versus like what's going on over here. So I have some scraps that I need to take care of behind here. It is not fully done. I have some scraps to finish up the back of here and to fill in just some of the other bigger like pieces that you can see over here. And so I'm going to do that with the blue now. And then whenever I get the white, we're just going to do the same thing. All right. So starting at the top of the blue side, I redid how my books were. So these are all the books that I've read and I just kind of redid how they looked on here. And I really, I really like it. I think it just has more dimension. Um, I might try to find something to like, maybe put in some of the other empty spaces or especially up on this top one. I also like the books on the top here. So that is the blue side all complete, which is pretty cool. Uh, this is my books that I've read shelf. So I love it. And that's my, at least a little bit of my TBR. So I have to just finish that shelf whenever that wallpaper gets here. The new day, because Amazon dropped these off like right as I was leaving for my four hour hair appointment. I also want my TBR side to look fun, but I'm gonna make another video where I kind of make these more of my priority TBR reads because not everything on here is a priority TBR read for me this year. So I'm gonna change that, but I have more. And so hopefully we're gonna finish up this side in not as much time now that I kind of know what I'm doing. This will definitely work. I might really only need one roll, but I think I'm gonna need two for like little touch-ups and things like that. So let's see what we got. We have the majority of the sides done. There's these little, you can't really see them as well, but they hold a shelf. And so I'm going to have to work around those to try to finish up some siding. And then obviously behind the books too, I think I should have enough. And then the more I look at this side too, I like it. If I see little things, I also have some scraps to cover up. So hopefully the next clip is when we're completely done. <laughs> we are done. I love how this looks. I might add some more like personal artifacts to the top here. We'll see. But in my next video, I want to go over the books that I got from my book advent calendar. And then I want to redo this shelf with more of my priority TBR reads and then like secondary. And then I also can't I can definitely not fit all of the books that I have on my TBR on this shelf. And there's like, there's shelving below this too, but you, but you can't really see that. So uh, there are definitely going to be books that aren't, won't even be on these shelves that I'm going to have to put elsewhere. So I'll talk about those and why those are not a priority. So hooray!